How to stop crushing on someone. 8 effective tips for moving on. Crushing on someone can be a whirlwind of emotions. Exciting, confusing, and even a little nerve-wracking. But when it becomes clear that your crush isn't going to lead to anything more, it can feel like an emotional roller coaster with no end in sight. Unlike ending a relationship where you can look back on memories, a crush is built on fantasies, leaving you without concrete experiences to help you move on. If you're wondering how to stop crushing on someone, don't worry. You are not alone, and there are plenty of effective ways to manage those feelings and move on to healthier emotional spaces. In this article, we'll dive deep into eight practical, realistic, and even fun strategies that will help you stop crushing on someone and regain your peace of mind. 1. Focus on their flaws. It's easy to idealize someone you have a crush on. You often see them through rose-colored glasses, focusing only on their positive traits. But if you want to stop crushing on someone, you need to challenge that idealization. Think of their flaws. Everyone has them. Perhaps they have annoying habits, lack of hygiene, or personality quirks that aren't so charming after all. By shifting your focus to their negative qualities, you begin to see them as just another person, not an unattainable ideal. This mental switch is the first step in getting over your crush. 2. Limit contact with them. One of the toughest aspects of getting over a crush is constant exposure. If you're regularly seeing them at school, work, or social gatherings, it can feel nearly impossible to move on. The solution? Limit your interactions with them. This doesn't mean you need to cut them out completely, especially if you share a close circle of friends or mutual relationships. But when possible, reduce the frequency of one-on-one -on -one meetings or unnecessary communication. This will give you the space you need to stop thinking about them constantly and start shifting your focus back to yourself. 3. Stay off their social media. In today's digital age, social media can make it harder than ever to get over someone. Whether you're constantly checking their Instagram posts or stalking their Facebook profile, it's easy to stay fixated on your crush. But this can hinder your ability to move on, unfollow, mute, or simply resist the urge to scroll through their posts. By staying away from their social media, you eliminate unnecessary triggers that keep you thinking about them. Social media can make it feel like they are always in your life, but in reality, you're just one click away from letting go. 4. Allow yourself to cry. Getting over a crush isn't always easy, and it's completely normal to feel sad about it. If you're wondering how to stop crushing on someone, Sometimes the answer is to let yourself feel the pain. Have a good cry and allow yourself to mourn the idea of what could have been. Watching a sad movie, eating ice cream in your pajamas, or simply lying in bed and processing your emotions can provide you with the emotional release you need. Crying doesn't make you weak. It makes you human. By expressing your feelings, you allow yourself to heal and move forward. 5. Dive into your hobbies and passions. One of the best ways to take your mind off your crush is to focus on what makes you happy and fulfilled. Get back to your hobbies, whether it's painting, playing music, reading, or working on a new project. Immersing yourself in activities that bring you joy can help boost your self-esteem and distract you from constantly thinking about your crush. It's a fantastic way to remember that you are an amazing person with your own interests and goals, independent of anyone else. 6. Clear out the reminders. Pictures, gifts, text messages. Everything that reminds you of your crush needs to be put away. It's easy to hold on to mementos, hoping for a change, but these objects only serve to reinforce your feelings. Instead, Pack them away in a box or remove them from your living space. Out of sight, out of mind is a practical strategy here. If you must keep them, store them somewhere you won't see them regularly. Removing reminders from your environment helps your brain let go and accept that this chapter is over. 7. Go out and enjoy life. Sometimes, all you need is a change of scenery. 
Get out of your house, surround yourself with friends, and start exploring new places. Whether it's a weekend getaway, trying out a new coffee shop, or joining an event in your city, getting out there can distract you and open up new opportunities. Not only will this help you stop thinking about your crush, but you'll also meet new people and experience life from a fresh perspective. The more you focus on living your best life, the less space there will be for those feelings of longing. 8. Start dating again, when you're ready. Once you've healed and feel ready to open your heart again, it might be time to start dating. Jumping back into the dating world is a great way to get over a crush. There's no rush, but keep in mind that there are plenty of other people out there who could be a better match for you. The sooner you allow yourself to meet new people and develop new crushes, the sooner you'll realize that there are always more exciting possibilities in life. Final thoughts. Embrace the journey of letting go. Crushing on someone is an emotional roller coaster, and sometimes, it's tough to figure out how to stop crushing on someone when you're in the middle of it. But remember, feelings fade with time. By actively applying these strategies, you will find that your crush slowly becomes a distant memory, and your emotional energy shifts toward new, exciting experiences. Allow yourself to feel sad, take time for self-care, and focus on what makes you happy. As you take steps toward healing and moving on, you'll be better prepared for future relationships and more equipped to handle the next time love knocks on your door. Remember, it's okay to let go. The world is full of endless possibilities, and by learning to move past a crush, you make room for new and more fulfilling relationships. So, take a deep breath, focus on yourself, and trust that better things are on the way. You got this. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below, and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end. Also make sure to check out our next highlighted video, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.